footstep restaurant is a restaurant with a difference. No, we don't have a set menu. In my case, you eat what you feel to eat. Back in Maine, stewed fish with roasted breadfruit and plantain, or curried lamb and rice and peas. If that's what a diner wants, it's been that way at Ferdy's Footsteps for the last 33 years. Our restaurant do strictly local foods. You come by us and we give you ground provisions, plantains, seasoned banana, two green peas, and those type of stuff we give you. Chef Ferdinand Tony, or Ferdy, as everyone calls him, wants his diners to feel like they're at home. That's why his kitchen has no doors. And you could stay, come and talk to any kitchen while you're preparing, and that's how we operate the business to you. Following Ferdy's footsteps does take time. This chef doesn't even begin to prepare a dish until it's been ordered. So it takes a little while to have it done. Sometimes people get upset and say they're waiting too long. But you know, once you go in a good restaurant, you gotta wait for food. <laughs> <laughs> However, locals and tourists agree that the food at Ferdy's Footsteps is well worth the wait. At Ferdy's Footsteps in Georgetown, St. Vincent, I'm Melissa Noel.